Ooh. Yeah, so these customs are fire. Keenan is a guy that has always done my customs in the big leagues. It's got the plus one effect on it. Got Mama Mish, my wife, on it. And then keep that chip, just like always just, you know, have that chip when you step on that field, you know what I mean? I'm Tony Kemp with the Oakland Athletics. I play second base and outfield. Welcome to my locker. <laughs> We're gonna start with the gamer. I've had this. I've had this for about since 2014. So I think I was there the day you. Yeah, that club up. this is like old, old. But this is my baby. You know, I feel like that's a beauty. Yeah, it's uh, you break gloves in, and sometimes it just doesn't get broken in the same way. What's the what's the um, what's like the the brown uh, cloud that's going? Yeah, on? all of this is just. Uh, Actually, hey, can I see your conditioner real quick? <laughs> this is some of the best conditioner that I use. Seth Brown, shout out to Seth Brown. <laughs> Horseman's one step. Yeah. Okay. It's like horse shampoo or something? What is that? Yeah. We're no saddle. It's for a horse saddle. It's for a horse saddle. But when you put it in your glove, it just gets that brown, but it gets that stick. You know what I mean? Like, you don't have to like, you're diving for a ball, you don't have to like close it all the way. It's just like pff, sticks a certain way. That's what I love. I think this is a, yeah, 1786. So this is like classic throwback version. And then customize the yellow for Oakland. This is a DP 15, but I like to have fun with the gloves. Obviously been a Wilson guy, A2000. It's an outstanding colorway yeah. for, for, the, for the Kelly Greens on yeah. Friday. Mm -hmm. Little custom, the limit, the, uh, the limit does not exist. It's kind of like a, you know what I mean? Yeah. What, is that, what does that mean to you? It's actually from the, it's like from the Matrix. So uh, they're like bending the spoon, like with like his, you know, his powers. And it's kind of like the same thing on the field. Like the limit doesn't exist. So you go and you, you do your thing mm -hmm. and, to me, you just the limit doesn't exist. Go higher than it. Um, we're gonna go through some Oakleys real quick. I've always been a fan of these Oakleys, so uh, the prisms have kind of been my favorite. Um, gotta have some different options. So I just like how the blue goes with the green. So we got these. Do you hit with those? Don't hit with them. No. Don't hit with them. Only in the field. No, I I wish I could hit with shades on, but it's just a different. When you're in that Oakland box, it's just different. I don't know. I just got used to it, I guess. Uh, these are like a lighter green, and I put some pink on there for my daughter, McKenna. So um, I like these too, just because they're different. Like people really haven't seen these customs really. Fire. Yeah. It matches Tyler Wade's uh, glove. Yep. <laughs> so like a little like mint. And then these are just, you know, white with yellow, just, you know, matching up with the jersey. Nothing crazy. You think you guys, I think you guys have the best jerseys. I think, the I think the, the Kellys, Kellys, the Kellys are hot. Uh, so I don't know if you guys know about Mims bands, but um, back in the day, like Barry Bonds, Larkin, like these guys would rep these bands and this guy is really close with Dusty Baker and James. and yeah James great dude and he kind of two years ago he hooked me up and said like you know I got approved by Josh Harrison and stuff so these are the wristbands that I wear it's got my face on it got my signature one of my favorite Bible verses so, so Josh Harrison like made you like yeah you can't like just be like, hey, I want your wristbands. You gotta, you gotta be invited into the fraternity. So, uh, shout out to James Men's Bands. I appreciate it. This is uh, always on my left wrist during the game. What's, what's the Bible verse? So the Bible verse is, do not throw away your confidence because it will be richly rewarded. Just like always a reminder of like when you step on the field, like you always gotta have confidence. You like never, never waver out there. And, like the minute that you waver, you're you're done. I gave me goosebumps. I like yeah. that. Yeah. Um, That's a metaphor for life. Yeah. Honestly, I'm an old school. T like this, I've used this glove since 2014. Uh, just a regular classic trapeze. 
Um, you know, this is, I call this Venus flytrap, you know, it's, uh, nothing really gets out of this globe when, <laughs> when I'm out there, so, yeah, use the same conditioner, uh, the horseman <laughs> stuff for this one, too. Um, yeah, these, yeah, these gloves have been, you know, I think that's the last thing I want to worry about is my glove not being broken in enough when I'm out there trying to make a play, so. Uh, KP92, is that the KP92, yeah, you guys know it. Um, Man, as far as like batting gloves, you guys, uh, these are like if I'm wearing if I'm wearing road grays, I'm always gonna be wearing these with some of the. Um, let's see if I got some of them in here. Shout out to Vandy. Oh, sick. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, so these customs are fire. Um, Keenan is a guy that has always done my customs in the big leagues. It's got the plus one effect on it. Got Mama Mish, my wife, on it. Um, and then keep that chip, just like always just, you know, have that chip when you step on that field, you know what I mean? And uh, it's got the Tennessee logo right there. Did like the checkered laces, which is actually pretty dope as well. He, uh, he does a good job. Yeah, so I'll be rocking these this year too. I'm probably gonna send him another pair to uh, get custom as well, but. that's nice. Yeah, he does a good job with those. Keenan, IKB custom. Shout out to Keenan. Um, for this year, I mainly keep it regular, man. I mean, let's see. These are the ones that I'm wearing right now that he custom plus one on the effect on the side. What's that plus one effect? Remind us, because I know what. It's yeah, cool. yeah, for sure, for sure. A little reminder. What? what? Uh, digging. digging. <laughs> and then also, I feel like these are some of the best yellows that we have. I mean, I when I signed with Nike last year, I, and I the rep's been great. Shout out to Sabrina. Um, I just said, hey, like, if you got any of these yellows left over, like, send them my way, so she sent me another four pair. But I'll be checking out. I think Sadashim showed you guys the new Nikes that are coming. Yeah. But like I said, if I like a pair, I'm sticking with it. Yeah. As far as the plus one effect, it's just an initiative I started in 2020 with the George Floyd murder. And uh, it was just about having open and honest conversations with people about race. And, you know, not everyone grows up the same. And everybody has different backgrounds. Everybody has different things that they have to go through in life. And when I started the initiative, it was kind of a, a, a smaller topic to, to discuss. And then it turned into this big, huge uh, discussion with, you know, over 300 people in my DMs talking with people about race and the flag and kneeling for the anthem to George Floyd to, you know, being called the Oreo growing up and different things like that. So I was just trying to be as open as possible. And, you know, it led to a lot of a lot of good. And uh, you know, still continuing the conversations these days is something that I always look forward to. So the plus one effect has gotten a lot bigger than anything I could have imagined. And, you know, it's all about talking with one person in a positive way and talking about race in a discussion that hopefully they can take that conversation and give it to somebody else. And that's kind of like the, the trickle down effect. And that's kind of where the plus one effect happened is just talking about race in a manner where you can talk to somebody and you can walk away and not be upset with each other and um yeah it's it, it's been great i don't know if i've ever asked you why number five yes <laughs> so seven is actually my number but uh when i got here when i got here they had five and um it was always just a, a great number my wife it's one of my wife's favorite numbers and uh i think the single digit just looks nice and uh, you know, when you're in the big leagues, I, I feel like it's tough to get a single digit these days. So, you get a single digit, you got to hold on to it as long as you can. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I mean, that means, that means, you're, that means you're a starter, basically. Yeah, yeah, no, no doubt. Yeah, no doubt, no doubt, no doubt. <laughs>